Today's story is Angry Cookie. Oh, not you again. Ugh, it's so bright. My eyes. Close this book this very second, you nosy noodle. Don't even think about turning the page. I am warning you. I am very angry. And there is nothing you can do about it. You are so annoying. Mind your own business. Goodbye. The end. Uh, hello? Um, <clears throat> cough, cough. Hint, hint. Meaning, go away. Close this book now. Oh, still here, are you? Well, 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 I guess if you're planning on sticking around, perhaps I can tell you a little bit about why I'm so angry. That doesn't mean we are going to be friends or anything, so don't get any funny ideas. It all started yesterday when my roommate, Barbara, got on her new recorder. She only knows this one terrible song and keeps playing it over and over again. I hate the recorder. And you're not even allowed to use the word hate, but I just did. So there. And then all the delicious, yummy strawberry pudding toothpaste ran out. So I had to use the grown-up spicy kind. Ugh, it burns! And then I had to get my hair cut. It was hanging in my eyes, you see. Cookies need haircuts too, you know. But I let my barber try a new look on me. And my hair looked worse. So now I have to wear this hat. And no hats even fit my big round head because I am a cookie. And they don't make hats for cookies, do they? Furious, I then took myself and the hat to the ice cream parlor. I had my heart set on the best, most wonderful vanilla sundae. With hot caramel sauce and whipped cream and marshmallows and hundreds and thousands and millions of chocolate sprinkles and even a red cherry on top, served in a tall glass. But they had run out of the best, most wonderful vanilla sundae with hot caramel sauce and whipped cream and marshmallows and hundreds and thousands and millions of chocolate sprinkles and even the red cherry. They did have the tall glass. But it was empty! On my way home, a bird tried to snack on me. Get off! Shoo! I shouted. But I don't think cookies are heard. Maybe that's why I'm so angry at the whole world. Because nobody listens to me. Nobody sticks around. Although, I guess you are still here, aren't you? Wow, that is a nice surprise. I guess my haircut isn't so bad. Perhaps I can maybe take this too small hat off. And actually, Barbara's song isn't so annoying. When you get used to it. Maybe my glass isn't so empty after all. I don't even need ice cream when I have you. You keep coming back. You listen to me even when I'm being a grumpy lump. A meanie, moody, moany mongoose, a sulky sandwich, a horrid hump, an angry cookie. You're still here. And that makes me not so angry anymore. In fact, I feel happy. And that is why you keep coming back, right? Thanks, friend. Oh, Barbara.